Hey everybody, Derek here from Addictive Tips, and in this video we're going to be dealing with Lutris. So to start off, uh, this is how to manage your games on Linux uh, with the Lutris app. Please check the link in the description to learn how to sync your Steam games if you want to do that. I'm going to be working on the generic uh, Linux games. So to start off, we need to create a new runner. So to go over here, we uh, to add this, we'd go to Game and click Add. Uh, we type in the name of the game and call it T Worlds. Then we go to Game Options, Executable. We would go to other locations, computer, user, games, and then this is our folder. Executable arguments, working directory would be, once again, computer, uh, user, games, and just let it run through there. And uh, click save. And then we've got T-Worlds right here. We can click play right now, and we are in the game. Now I'm going to restart this program here really quick. And uh, it should allow it to show my Steam games, which I had it synced. And it will also hopefully show the T-Worlds app that I just added. There we go. Okay, so here's the game that we just added. And this is, like I said, this is how you can manage your games. If I go through here, I can click install. As long as I log into my Steam account, it'll work through there. If I, if I link my wine stuff, it'll go through there as well. And of course, if you go to the app here, the website, you can, you know, get your own games. Like they have an open gaming platform. Some stuff is free, some stuff is paid. Uh, it's pretty awesome. And uh, I really enjoy it. Uh, so uh, we can click install, like I said, and uh, it will go to go through the Lutris account if you're signed in and all that. Anyways, guys, uh, just a quick little video on how to organize and launch games through the uh, Lutris app. Let's join really quick to uh, just show you what this is like. As you can see, the game works just fine, and the app is managing it. But uh, anyways, guys, I hope you enjoyed this video. Uh, please check out the game T-Worlds, by the way. It's really cool. And I will see you in the next video.